The Bill Nato family has played a leading role in building Portland into the city we know today. And now they're hoping to help build up the people of Oregon. Yeah, just minutes ago, they made an unprecedented investment in a suicide and substance abuse prevention organization, Lines for Life. Elise Haas is live from Lines for Life to tell us about this donation. Elise? Yes, Ken and Jenny. So Oregon has one of the highest suicide rates in the nation, and the NATOs just announced that they are going to be donating $1 million to Lines for Life. And this is a huge deal for Portland and for Oregon, because for every one suicide, there are at least 280 people who are thinking about it or considering it, but don't go through with it. And Lines for Life de-escalates an overwhelming majority of their crisis calls, more than 95% of them, helping those who are struggling find hope and healing. And today the NATO family has decided to make this gift of a million dollars as part of a broad investment in social change and social justice in Portland. And Ann NATO Campbell says that she has experienced mental crisis in her own family and she sees people struggling here on the streets and she knows this will help save tens of thousands of lives. Last year Lines for Life for example took over 110,000 calls, texts and emails helping more people than ever. And this generous gift to Lions for Life will allow them to expand and do more projects that they have never been able to do before and they would, would not be able to do without. And so if you or you know somebody that you love is struggling or in crisis, just know that Lions for Life is always there. Reporting live in Southwest Portland, Elise Haas, Coin 6 News. Yeah.